There we go. Save the video. That's what I should do. to meditate have been rare since Samarak returned to elsewhere. This one needed some time alone, especially after helping Tharn with the dragon at the Shadow Dance ruins. But you look like one who has important news, my friend. Tanera wants us to gather at the Moon Gate of Anequina. Zamarak suspected that would be our next destination. This one noticed that the moons have shifted in the sky moving in a way that breaks their usual pattern. The betrayer's doing, yes? At least you and Queen Kamira returned from the ruins. The betrayer sent the moons to eclipse, but we killed him, and Kamira is now attuned to the, to the lattice. Then we still have a chance. Zamarak has pledged his honor to Queen Kamira. He will not break that vow. This one has a purpose again, and we'll see it through, no matter the cost. Zamarak will meet you at the Moon Gate, my friend. I'll see you at the Moon Gate. Queen Kamira, attuned to the Lunar Lattice. Zamarak never expected to see such a miracle in his lifetime. This one prays that it will be enough when we stand against the dragons. Speaking of dragons, what happened after Kamira and I entered the temple? About what you would expect. Tharn used flashy spells to confuse the dragon until it finally gave up and flew away. Then, we encountered the squad of Euraxians led by a necromancer. Those Zamarek dispatched. It was the least this one could do. <laughs> Good job, Zamarek. The last necromancers in the world. Enemies are good team. used to rejuvenate me after periods of intense exertion and spell casting. Now I can barely taste the stuff. A good thing too. Kajiti wine is cloyingly sweet, like drinking candy plums boiled in moon sugar. I presume you have news? Can they now pass it again at the moon gate of the Nequina? The moon gate? A noble but futile proposition, I fear. The Khajiit should pack up and flee while they still can. Let the Alliance armies deal with this. Show them some fights are more important than deciding whose posterior best fits the ruby throne. Are you suggesting we give up at that time? No, no. Just pondering other options. Too much of what we're facing was the inadvertent result of my actions or the actions of my family. Dragons, Euraxians, necromancers. The responsibility falls to me and balance must be restored. So you're still, so you're still with us? Would you stand a chance otherwise? Without my arcane and strategic insights, anything you try is destined to fail. I won't have that on my conscience. Now, allow me to finish this sickeningly sweet inebriant. One last indulgence before the end. I see you at the moon gate. By the way, I believe I understand the purpose of the Dragonhorn. 
After much consideration, the use and function of the ancient instrument has become clear. The Dragon Guard were clever. I'll say that for them. You know how to use the Dragon Guard? Theoretical knowledge isn't the same as practical experience, but I believe I understand the fundamentals of its operation. The Dragon Guard prepared a horn taken from a massive dragon and engraved it with arcane runes, giving it astonishing power. The dragon's horn is actually a dragon's horn? Oh yes, I'm fairly certain of that. And I found historical references indicating the Dragon Guard gifted such relics to key locations. For their protection, you see. The one you located was originally in Rimen before it was moved to the sanctuary. Ah, so how do we use it? We have neither the time nor resources to move the large relic, but the small horn you brought back, it's called a combat horn by the way, was designed to be carried into battle. Once charged with energy, its sound weakens dragons. The man charged the horn at the Shadow Dice Temple. One problem solved then. The next is sheer age. This ancient combat horn is exceedingly fragile. I'm not sure how many times we can sound the horn before it disintegrates into dust. For that reason, I suggest we save it until we absolutely need it. Same thing as Camera said. Goodbye. Alright, now I just have to find Casper. Oh, please find Carlo too. Need to find him as well. between battles. I like to spend the time catching up in my reading. History, military strategy, recipe books. My secret pleasure is a good mystery though. And the new investigator veil is a real page turner. <laughs> nice. Camila wants us to get it at the moon gates of an equinox. I've been waiting for the order to move out. I sent most of the Cygnus irregulars on ahead with Garishri, but a small contingent remained here in case our earlier guess was wrong. I assume events in the ruins confirmed our theory? Yes, I get that betrayer. But not before he said the moon's in motion to open the moon gate. Understood. We need to defend the moon gate and stop the dragons from using it when it opens. Keep them from reaching Jode's core. Well, at least now we have a mission. And just hope the Khajiit can get over their aversion to working with my troops. Has that been my trapper in... Integrating your forces with the Khajiit? Queen Euraxia's tyranny made the Khajiit wary. I don't blame them for that. I just want to show them that not all Imperials are tyrants. That they can trust at least a few of us. It will come. As long as we don't turn on each other first. I see you at the moon gate. I actually started to think he is actually a good man. If anything is going to happen with these irregulars, I do not think it is going to be him that is going to do it. Ah, there he is. Oh, this is what they got to watch. Oh, okay. This is what they got to bear. Take in a before the battle cleansing. I find it prudent to make myself pristine prior to the start of a slaughter. In my experience, the subsequent blood and gore adheres much better to a well laundered body. Camera wants us to get at the moon gate of the Arenequina. The moon gate? I hope to wash away the memories of the betrayer, but some stenches can't be removed with soap and water. I'm sorry I made the moons move, my friend. Sorry I helped the dragons. How much adventure I can run, not you? 
But before I became the gallantly gaunt soul's ribbon form you see today, I was the betrayer. I originally did all the terrible deeds that led us to this place. I'm, I'm rather ashamed. Dash it all. So half past six years. Okay, but half past Dr. Dragon by reaching George Gore. Yes, of course, that was my plan all along. Make up for my past atrocities by helping the nice cat people defeat the evil dragons. Just like the hero I was before I became the betrayer. Tally ho then, I'll head to the moon gate now and meet you there. I see you at the moon gate. As nice as these facilities are, I miss the boiling plasm pools of cold harbor. Hot enough to melt the skin right off your bones. What an invigorating sensation. <laughs> Might I write a rest of your armor? And your point is? Nothing. Goodbye. Ahead. <laughs> Ready. So that is where they come to clean. And un un understood. <laughs> Learn more and more about things in this game. In this game. Alright. Uh, this one is going to go to the street. Start a things. And then she will be back out. Yeah, probably. Oh, that's poison damage. Never mind. After one, after the moon gate. <sighs> ah, here we are. All right. Just uh, dash it all. And there's a dragon here, there too. That is great. 